So here's an odd topic. So I was just driving and um, just saw a guy almost get hit jaywalking through rush hour traffic because people were kind of stopped but one lane wasn't. And so he's trying to run across the lane into the lane where there's oncoming traffic. Almost just got totally taken out. Anyhow, so started to make me think about things that people think are unsafe and things, uh, perceptions of what is safe. And made me think about uh, riding my bike, um, the motorcycle, and everybody who doesn't ride is, you know, their first thing. And you'll, if you currently ride, you definitely know what I'm talking about. And if you are thinking about riding, I'm telling you this just so you prepare for it because there's not one person you're going to talk to if they don't ride. Um, that's not going to bring up, be safe, or I hope you don't get in a wreck and die. And, like, they'll say crazy shit that you would never say to somebody. Like, people that smoke cigarettes, for example, like, people don't go up to them and be like, I hope you die of lung cancer, or you know you're going to die of cancer. Like, I just don't know why, but people just way overstep their boundaries, and they don't just say, you know, be safe, which is fine. I mean, that's nice. It's nice that people care about you. Um, but people will just say the craziest things to you and you're like, dude, I'm just going to get groceries. If anybody, you need to watch out for me. So instead of you telling me be safe, Hey, watch out for my motorcycles because it's cars that hit a lot of bikes and cause a major majority of accidents is cars that don't see bikes. So I'm almost thinking from now on when people say, Hey, uh, make sure you drive safe. I'll be like, Hey, make sure you look out for me on the roads. Um, cause that's kind of how I feel about it. But yeah, so safety. So people's perception on what's safe. So this dude's just jaywalking through the street with all these vehicles. Um, and I saw a guy earlier today, um, who's riding a bicycle in traffic in the lane. And it's not like this, like right here, there's no, there's no sidewalks, but this was a, like through almost a residential area and guys on a uh, put it on a car street he's on a boulevard and instead of using the sidewalk to ride his bike he's riding in the middle of the road surrounded by cars like uh, two lanes both ways unmarked lanes that are doing 40 50 miles an hour and people will tell motorcyclists to be safe and I'm like okay so you got a guy jaywalking almost gets hit by a car you got a guy in a bicycle and people smoking I mean you can go on and on and on but it just makes me basically say that you take the motorcycle safety course you prepare yourself for when you're going to ride Ooh, snuffers mm, if you don't know better ask somebody uh, again I'm in Dallas so if you're familiar with where I'm at um, this is the uh, North Dallas area um, Addison I guess you'd call it um, anyhow um, yeah, people who have their own, what they think safe. So what you want to do is minimize your own risk. Um, always be a student of riding. Every day you go out, try to become a better rider. Um, don't push yourself into situations that you don't know how to handle. Be prepared for things and kind of mentally run through the reps of, if you see like a car coming out, like if there's a car here, if he comes out, I'm on my bike and I don't I don't have a GoPro yet so that's why you're riding along with me in the car but um, you know if a car pulls out in front of me what am I gonna do where's my escape how would I treat it Would I slam on the brakes Would I give it get like literally run through those mental reps because sometimes that can be just as good as actual practice because if you're mentally thinking about defensive driving or, or proactive riding um, I just think it makes you a better rider, and you can eliminate a lot of the accidents that might occur to people who aren't paying attention. Um, but, uh, yeah, mitigating risk. Anyhow, just an odd topic came to me. I'm still stuck in traffic. Gotta love it.